What is going on everybody? It is the Megalodon or the Magia? Uh And I am currently in the process of being asked to do a battle So, uh, I am actually all for it So we're gonna make- we're probably gonna be able to start out this Uh, sure, yeah, so in this episode we're probably gonna do a battle with this gold rank So I am only a bronze rank Uh, so yeah, things are probably going to get a little sketchy But I am all for it, I mean like, I have no sh- like, I won't this, I've got nothing to lose, right? So there's not really anything. And I do believe the Jodo Safari Zone. Uh, I do believe the Jodo Safari Zone is somewhere uh, uh, around this city, though. Now, there's the gym. We're going to be taking that on this episode. Hopefully. Hope against hope. <laughs> now, I think that's just a beach. It doesn't look like there's anything over there. Well, there's some rock smashes over here. And I do believe this is where you get Shuckles, uh, Krabby, what's this, uh, Plume Fossil, what even is that, I don't know, but all I know is that something I don't need, ooh, this is where you get Shuckles. Okay, that's very nice, but I don't need another Shuckle because I have already used all my TMs, Revive, don't need. I mean, it would be lovely to get like an Impish Shuckle, or maybe like a Calm Shuckle. But honestly, like, I really used my TM, so, yeah. And, wait, where, where did I even just go into? I just, like, randomly came into a cave. Uh, Cliff Edge Gate. Interesting. Right, there's a Rock Smash over here. Kingler, okay. Oh, there's another rock smash over here. Uh, max ether. I really don't need that. Let's keep coming over here. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's another rock smash over here. Was it cut out of order? Ah, okay. That explains it. Mm, all right. Let's. Looks like we're out. Uh. Where do we go? By the looks of things, uh, we need to go west. Uh, seems like there's a few bridges uh, over a river. And there's a few trainers scattered around here, so we're going to battle them. Probably with Kingdra, it looks like these are rock trainers. So Kingdra is going to do pretty well. Done sparse. Uh, let's just try Surf. Must slap. Another done sparse. Okay, let's just try Surf again. Alright, we gotta finish him off quickly. Uh, Ice Beam. Okay, phew, luckily it just ended there. If I got put to sleep, uh, it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. I mean, I can always just like poke heal. Uh, what's, it, what's over in here? Uh, Knockdown, Mill Tanks, Radicates. Uh, let's come up here. Let's see what's up here. Hmm. Oh, this is where you get to the other bridge. Okay, what about uh, what you get from going down? Oh, there's a portal. Oh, this is where you get Mega um, uh, Steelix, but I'm not star level 2 yet, so I can't, where does this, oh, this leads us down to the base of the, oh, there's a hidden poke, Stardust, can be sold to shop, okay, let's go back up there though, because we don't need to be at the bottom of the mountain, let's, oh, there's a waterfall, oh, it's actually really nice scenery, dude, if this was like survival mic or something, I would love making it my home here. It seems to be a Pokeloot here. Uh, revive, just throw that away. And let's fight this trainer, Jack. Uh, let's go Dragon Pulse. And Onyx, we can go with a Surf. Doesn't kill it because it's got Sturdy. Uh, okay, but another one should do it. And let's keep heading on this way. I think we might need to climb up a little bit. I think the lower bridge just ends right there. Uh, if we can climb up, that is. No, we can, we can. Okay, panic over, panic over. Doesn't seem to be anything over here, though. Just like glooms. Oh, dittos. <laughs> wow, this place sports a lot of dittos. They're absolutely everywhere. Lag and tail that just makes you slow. I don't know why anyone would want that. Uh, seems to be some sort of place over here. Browse graphics. Oh, that's quite peculiar. 
uh, Fero's ground. Alright, let's cross over here because I think we missed some things over here. Uh, Radicates, Ditto's. This Ditto is absolutely all over the place. Uh, there seems to be some uh, like some flat grounds over here. Maybe there's gonna be something over here, or maybe it's just just judging by the mini map. I think this is just going to be the end of this area. There's some stairs, but I don't think any Pokemon uh, does spawn here. So yeah, I'll probably leave this place uh, to itself in general. Everything is anything. It might be a coming soon area. So, but for now, let's just cross to the other side of the waterfall where there's greenery instead of this like barren dirt land. Ooh, uh, Hoppip spawned here, that's quite interesting. Volpixes, that would have been helpful when I was getting my Volpixes. Uh, but then again, they're such high level, I don't think they're as common as. No, they're quite common actually. But like the high level is going to make it hard to catch. Oh, okay. Hmm. Uh, Tauros and Farfetch seems to be very abundant in this area. Uh, Alright, let's cross the bridge over here. Uh, let's see what is over here. Just a bunch of Growlithes. Uh, nothing. Oh, there's a Pokeloot over here. Dire hit. Absolutely useless. We're going to get rid of that. There's. Oh, Safari Zone! Okay, this is where the Jodo uh, Safari Zone is. Wow, it looks a lot better than the Kanto one. Um, okay, let's have an explore of the Jodo Safari Zone then. Looks like we're going. To, yeah, there's the Poke Center. Yeah, let's actually. Um, how about let's not take the gym and instead explore the Jodo Safari Zone this episode? That might be a better uh, option to do. Let's see what. Oh, I see red letters. Coming soon. <laughs> okay, hopefully it's not another Cerulean case if you know what I'm saying. Uh, but yeah, well that's absolutely poop. And then at least there's a Poke Center over here, so we, let's use this to uh, walk back to Sinewood City. Okay, we're back, and uh, we might as well take on the gym. Uh, I'm not too sure what type it is. I think it's fighting or was it like ice? I'm not too sure. Or maybe it was. I'm not sure. Uh, this is the yep. The thirteen gym next to uh, back across the water. Okay. I can't believe that into the fighting gym. Okay, fighting gym. Whoa. Okay, this is quite a unique style of indoor decor. Right, yeah, let's fight this person first of all. Uh, fighting. What's good against fighting? A uh, psychic, flying, flying. Okay, Heracross is gonna be pretty good. Uh, cause he's got that uh aerial ace. Uh, there seems to be something. Can we jump? Oh, I think is that the gym leader? I think that might be the gym leader in there. Okay, but we're first not gonna worry about that. We're first going to take on some of the things over here. Focus engine, oh, he's getting pumped. Alright, take him out pretty quickly. Alright, Machamp. Come on, Dynamic Punch. Really, it landed and it confused me. That is so not cool, but at least uh, uh, I didn't hurt myself in confusion. Let's take down some other. I believe those portals will take me to the gym leader. Let's see, hit him on top. Uh, took down about half of it, come on, don't kill me, close combat, wow, it's absolutely nothing. Uh, because I am actually, uh, part fighting too, so of course it's gonna not do much against me, fighting moves, screech. There it is, wow, um, uh, what's it called, Heracross is getting some great XP over here, hit on Shan. Doesn't get, whoa, what does he use? I didn't see what he used, but something did a lot of damage to me. Now the super pokey heal and uh, aerial ace is. Let's just confirm. Yeah, it is a physical move, so let's actually put a choice band uh, on him, and let's actually put all of the respective uh, held items on these Pokemon. So let's take the training items off, like take off the lucky eggs and the XP share and whatnot. 
put the tr uh, bell on. So light clay is going to go on Mugel. Normally Toxel is going to go on him, but because he's probably only going to be using Aerial Ace, just going to go Choice Band. Scope Lens goes on Kingdra. Uh, Leftovers goes on Shuckle. Uh, Charcoal goes on Ninetales, and Magnet goes on Jolteon. That's good. Now let's go into this portal. If it's going to. Oh! Okay, here is the gym leader. Okay, so we're going to first Poke Heal, and let's send out with uh, Shuckle, obviously. He's only got four Pokemon, that's not a lot for a. I mean, find gym leader Chuck, okay, that's good. At least they're not Steve's anymore. <laughs> send out with Champ, okay, let's go with Stealth Rock, and a Sticky Web. He shouldn't be able to one bang me theoretically. Alright, Dynamic Punch. Wow, really? I hurt myself in confusion. What is the like? Okay, uh, let's try Toxic. Probably won't be able to work though. Yep. Oh, why did I just send out? I just sent out this guy. Um, let's see how much we can do with Blizzard. Oh my god, Dynamic Punch does a lot. Right, but I think it should be a double KO. Oh no, we actually. Okay. He has a Heracross. He has a Mega Heracross. Okay, this is actually. Not looking as good as I thought it would be. Alright, what's gonna happen? I hurt myself in confusion. You're kidding me. Okay. Let's send out Nine Tails because he is half bug. Yep, that was very, very good. Polyrath. Oh, yeah, because Polyrath is uh, half fighting, isn't it? Rain Dance. Okay. Let's try this. Alright, yeah, oh, that, yeah, because it's raining and it was, the sunlight wasn't uh, bright, that's why my attack did less, but Thunderbolt did pretty good. Primate, uh, let's try this. Thrash, oh my god, okay, we nearly did a double KO there. Oh, but we've done it, nice, two gems down in this episode. Uh, let's click this. Alright, we got a Storm Badge, we can put it there, and we got Focus Punch TM. That is pretty good, GG. Now we can uh, actually start heading uh, back to the mainland, back to Olivine City. And I believe we need to take down the radio tower in there. So we don't have to go back through the rural islands because what we can actually do is there's a sneaky little shortcut uh, that I accidentally discovered. Uh, if we come over here uh, along the uh, shore we are actually going to uh, be able to get back to Olivine City without having to cross the ocean or the rural islands or any of the like the um the annoying things like that. All right, but let's keep going. And as you can see, there's some light from the Rock Smash, shows that uh, there. Here we are just approaching it right now. I'm sorry, it may be this part may be a little bit boring, but we're going to get there very soon. And while we're here, actually, let's switch out some of our battle items, and let's put on our leveling items again. So let's put this on these. There it is. And we are now just approaching the rocks. Uh, we might as well try these. Who knows? Maybe uh, we'll get something good. Uh, let's see. Crabby. Not good. Comet Shard. Pretty good. Uh, Pearl. Not too bad. And Shelter. Not needed. And I think this is the way back to. Oh, red. Not currently release. Ah, face palm out of ten. Why does this happen all the time on this server? Ah, but I do have faith in the Pokeplay team. Hopefully, they will be able to finish it soon. All right, Olivine City. And actually, I forgot to mention something. I believe this is where we can get our own uh, fishing rods. So I believe in one. I think it's this house. Uh, uh, yep, yeah, we can buy a good rod. So I missed out on the old rod, and 
yep, we can now buy one here for 10,000. It's quite an expensive, like, uh, fishing rod in all honesty, but it doesn't matter, we've got it. There's the gym, we're going to be taking that on probably next episode. Uh, seeing as we do have some time left, we're probably going to take down the radio tower. There's a house up here, which I don't know how to get up onto. I know I said first sell some of our stuff. Uh, here. Uh, let's go starter sell, nugget sell, let's also sell that, uh, what's it called, uh, comet shard and that pearl. Give us a little bit of cash. So, uh, oh, this is, I believe, how you get to the house. That over there is the radio tower. Uh, there's a few more houses over here. Let's see if there's anything useful over here. Oh, there's a Pokeloot. Cherry Berry. I choose Paralysis, which is going to throw that away. Uh, nothing here. Yep, basically nothing with these houses at all. Well, let's then go ahead and take on the Radio Tower. Uh, can I ride on Shuckle? Uh, I don't even care if I could because it would be ridiculously slow. Oh no, this isn't the radio tower, this is um, the lighthouse, uh, the one at, what's it called, uh, Golden Rock City was the radio tower, sorry, I was getting them mixed up a little bit. Uh, let's just do a lap around to see if there's anything good around here, nope, I do not believe there is at all. So let's just go in. Uh, I don't think they're TMs. Oh no, da I believe Daz and Gleam is a TM, but soon will be missing TM. And uh, I have Daz and Gleam on my Alolan, uh, Alolan Ninetales. That was it. Female combi. I think I actually do have a combi, but I don't know if it's male or female. We're going to have to check later. Let's come up here. Right, and let's start uh, leveling, yeah. Do this here, knocked out. So with the flamethrower. Easy peasy. There's a, oh, that's just a lighthouse armor sand. Now let's take this guy, Poliwool, that was not a good matchup. Um, let's go Jolteon. Hypnosis, you have got to be kidding me. Come on, wake up, buddy, wake up. Ah, oh, wake up. Just wake up already, finally. Oh my god, okay, Polyrath. Ah, oh, no, you cheated, for God's sake. You put me to sleep. Let's see, a protein. Don't you wait, um, protein, is that attack? Yeah, I'm gonna, probably gonna keep that, actually. Ah, oh, there's a portal for us to go through here. There's a Pokeloot. Choice band, that's... Big! Oh my god, how many they give you one for free in this? Spearow, just gonna go with the flamethrower. Another Spearow. Uh, Fearow. You want because you're tired? No, I'm really, really tired actually. I think you might be able to tell from my voice. Quite tired. Uh, it's Arcanine. Let's just see how this does. Oh, he's flash fire. Okay, um, oh no, why did I send this guy? What am I doing? Uh, oh, he has two Arcanines? Okay, let's just try the Toxic stra toxic strat Strategy right now. Uh, let's try Stealth Rock. Fire Fang. You know, let's go with the rest. Now we're going to heal our health back. And then we can just keep stalling. Uh, but he's going to be taking damage from the poison. So as long as you just keep stalling like this, he, he is going to be dead. Just like that, isn't that handy? Now, oh, I avoid the attack. Oh, we both avoid the attack. Okay, Thunder Fang, let's go with the Toxic. And rest. And as you can see, Stealth Rock did a lot of damage as well. So I know this is a little bit tedi tedious, but this is how stallers take down their uh, enemies. With either toxic or as I said before, like infestation would do as well. Uh, it is a really, really handy 
way to uh, take down your opponents because they essentially can't do anything. Nice job, Shuckle. Let's keep on going. Ooh, what? Do I drop down here? Maybe I do. Let's have. Oh, this door. Yeah, I think I do. Okay. Seems to be a swimmer over here. Uh, so I'm going to now Jolteon against these swimmers. Uh, Krabby. Kingler. Got everything. There's a Pokeloot here. Potion. Potion. Okay. Come over here. It's a Pokeloot. Swagger. I might actually keep that. That is quite useful. I mean, it does increase their attack. But the confusion is quite handy. A zoom reel. Let's take that down. And I think there's going to be a boss at the top. Uh, Politoed. Let's go for that. Yeah, and I have a feeling the next. Oh, wow, the legit is a boss. But um, I th I thought I saw a Pokeloot down. Super potion. I used. I, I didn't mean a mega boss. Okay, I can't take it on though because I don't have two star levels. Oh, I wasn't able to get the um the Pokeloot up there. Well, I guess I will be getting that in between episodes. Uh, we still only got 20 minutes. You might actually try taking down the gym this episode. Uh, or maybe we could battle right now. Uh, let's whisper to Just Cause. Uh, once to battle now. Maybe we could end this off with a nice little player battle or trainer battle. Uh, the gym is over there. Right, yep, here's the gym. But if he doesn't respond, I guess we'll just take down the gym. This is the 14th gym. Uh, let's see what this gym is. It's all steel gym. Okay, 9 tails is going to be good again with uh, this one. I'm good. If you need to get off, it's fine. Uh, okay, well, that's some weird acting by him. Uh, is, are there any trainers in this one? This is like a cake factory <laughs> to me. Um, no, I think it's literally just the gym leader. So let's just try right. Oh, I should put on my items, damn it. Uh, oh well, I'm mean, like, you learn, right? You learn. Skarmory. Oh, he's got sturdy though. Stealth rock. I hate that so much. Steelix. Let's go with the flame. Mega Steelix. Uh, come on. One bang. Yes, okay, Magneton. I thought Magneton was only electric. Oh, he's got sturdy though, that's so annoying. Uh, but since I've got the sunlight on my time, this uh, uh, hidden ability is proving to be very useful. Uh, uh, Alolan Duck Trio, got it, everything. That was really, really easy. Let's click the gym. Alright, I've now got the mineral badge. And what's this? Iron Tail. Okay, yeah, that's probably going to be handy. Uh, no, actually, I don't think they're all going to be very handy. All right, let's do slash SB list and open our backpack and put all these TMs in there. There it is. Uh, and that really didn't take long. Um, I want it to be in video. So I do want to show off our team because currently we have not done any uh, trainer battles in uh, on screen. I have done some uh, off screen, but uh, you, none of you guys were able to see it. So I do want to verse someone on screen. Uh, it is a gold rank. Uh, so yeah, he is a gold rank. So I don't know if I will win or lose. I'm praying that I will win, but honestly, I really don't know. He d he knows a little bit of my team, but I know none of his team, so this is going to be interesting. Alrighty, let's put our battle items on. Uh, who should I put on, actually? Probably a lowly nine tiles, I would... Yeah, uh, I don't know. Yeah, probably a lowly nine tiles. Um, Magnet, because I don't have anything for uh, this guy otherwise, apart from the life four, but... It's not very good. Uh, should I go Toxic Orb or Light? Maybe let's go Life Orb. Oh uh, no, actually Choice Band worked uh, really well uh, in that time. So let's go with 
this. So yep, uh, he's right over here. We're not going to send out with Shakul because I don't want it be, to be him to be able to estimate what I'm sending out with. So let's just send out with my highest level, uh, Jolteon obviously. It's nearly max level. Max level is 120 levels. So it has only has 9 levels left before it is max level. So it looks like he's just getting his battle Pokemon out. That's okay, we'll wait for him a little bit. Alrighty, uh, in battle right over here. There it is. Alright, let's go to battle rules. Let's uh, raise the cap and full heal. It's going to turn all levels the same. We can do bad claws so we can't use like uh, potions of things. Uh, what else do we want? Um, yeah, I want legendary claws as well because I don't have any legendaries. So that would not be very good. Uh, I have done that. Alrighty, let's now send out with Shuckle, just to make it unpredictable. It's probably going to be sending out uh, a ground poke. Gengar? Interesting. Right, let's start setting up. Destiny Bond, okay, but uh, Shuckle can actually... There's nothing that Shuckle can actually do with Gengar. So he's going to use Shadow Ball. Who's okay? Uh, let's go with uh, this person, I believe. Oh, okay. Uh, let's go with an. Oh, he's falling asleep. Right, he's probably gonna use uh, Dream Eater now. So let's actually switch to this guy. Uh, we don't want him to get any Dream Eaters out. There we go. One bang him. Now, anyone else that he sends out now is going to get uh, effects from Stealth Rock and Sticky Web. You can see he's caught in a Sticky Web. His speed was decreased by Sticky Web and he's hurt by Stealth Rock. But what can Alolan Nine Tails do to Jolteon? That's like. Okay, well, we're gonna switch back to um, this guy to just tank a hit. This guy is uh, surprisingly tanky and Alolan Nine Tails is very weak against Poison. And guess what's our best move against him? That is poison, you're right. Alright, now let's just do exactly what we did on the radio tower. Let's keep using rest and make sure he keeps getting hurt from the poison. Dazzling Gleam is going to eventually keep getting hurt by the poison and then he's going to die. Let's use rest. And he is going to die. There you go. So that's a very, very interesting strat of how to take them down. Uh, let's try the same. He's going to go Dragon Dance. Oh, he's getting some sneaky Dragon Dance. Oh, that's outrageous. Huh. That might actually be a bit of an issue for me. i uh, send out this guy. And go with the Blizzard. Ooh, okay, that is definitely an issue that we're going to have to face. Uh, let's see that this guy, I'm not going to bother sending with the focus energy. Oh, yes, he's himself in confusion. Yes, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. He's got Raichu. I want to swap out because he's going to use Thunderbolt, so... Going to use... Uh, Heracross pretty much dead, like, anyway, so... I don't really care if he dies, in all, in all honesty. And he's a uh, Psychic Electric, so we're going to send out Jolteon and hit him with a Shadow Ball. There it is, super effective. Charizard, oh yeah, see he did a lot with the Stealth Rock, yeah, because 4 times effective, and I think we just won. Oh no, he still has one more, ah, oh, Blast Toys. <laughs> yeah, we just won. GG, no re. GG. Okay, and that is ending of the episode on a success. If you guys have enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel as it does help the channel a lot. And I will see you all next video where we'll probably take down, uh, we'll probably go through Mount Mortar. Bye everyone.